So Patricia, what got you into, uh, interested into fashion and acting and fashion? Let's start with fashion. Yeah. Who wouldn't love fashion? La fashion is an incredible choice of career, choice of wearing the clothing. Um, I was involved in a couple of pageants back in 2011 and one of course this year. Um, I love to look at the trends. I love Marc Jacobs, Marc Jacobs, um, Dolce and Gabbana. Um, I love um, Prada. All of those amazing designers, who wouldn't love? They're just exquisite and beautiful. And I just love the textures, the, the um, awesome uh, text lines and um, all the patterns and the trendy, the coats, the, um, the designer bags, sure Louis Vuitton. Um, I love, I love, I love um, uh, Marc Jacobs. I really love Marc Jacobs a lot. You know, I have a Marc Jacobs purse and a watch. I'm trying to get the watch now. I will be in Paris in December for the first time with one of my co-workers, um, and she's a famous model as well. She's working at a top agency in New York, and I'm looking to travel to L.A. soon. My agent actually lives in L.A., and he wants me there by December or January of next year. And I'm also studying journalism, which is, is going to be great for my career and what I want to do with the fashion industry. Eventually I want to evolve and um, become a designer, which is amazing because I truly love the, the, the joy of designing and putting clothes and patterns together and just come with that whole idea of coming and putting together a project which can help people in the long run with what they want to do with the clothing, which is wear it, you know, to go to a photo shoot, go to a video shoot, you know, do a rock a movie, maybe work with a, a spe specific movie, and maybe work with the whole designing team behind it. Um, I've been featured in a couple of films already. Um, one for That's Dominican, um, it's, a, it's called Viernes Trece, which is Friday the 13th. It's like a sequel to what the original, you know, Friday the 13th was. Um, and it was really nice. I spent four days in Connecticut at um, a house. It was like a really far away place and it was a transition for me because I'm never really, um, I was never a part of that whole film industry. Um, so for me to actually perform and actually be around that area in Connecticut and be like one of the only ones that didn't have that much um, experience in the field was transitioning phase for me and I truly loved it. Um, after that I worked in another film called High Heels in New York City um, and it was an incredible experience. We shot for five different days in New York City. Um, it was an incredible experience. I got to meet so many incredible people. Um, there's a, a, a designer um, and an agent there that I met. I showed him my portfolio and he was very interested in working with me. He's running an agency in New York City and in Asia. He works with a lot of famous designers and um, he wanted to book me for a lot of shows over there in Paris. So we'll see how that goes, um, how that will play off for me in the future. Um, hopefully that will be an incredible opportunity for me and um, hopefully I'll be tuning in with a lot of projects and I will be for sure showcasing a lot of my talent debut in the future. So stay tuned. In a short answer? Yes. Where do you see yourself in five years from now? Five years from now I see myself living large, living my dream which is you know becoming that top designer or you know fashion icon if you will and if not you know I'll definitely be involved in the acting industry I'll do more modeling I want to do some um, cover shoots hopefully um, and do you know more projects within the the fashion industry with with a lot of works and a lot of ideas that I have in mind what do you think sets you apart from the other girls well, what sets me apart from the other girls is that I have a really big, as a Sagittarius, as a fellow Sagittarians, Sagittarius, I have like this big mind and a big view of what I want to become. I just don't want to be, I don't want my career to be shallow. I don't want to be just a regular um, girl next door or top model or I don't want to do that. My perspective and my ideas are a lot more large than that. Yes, I want to continue my modeling career, but I also want to pursue acting. And I feel like acting can really take me to the next level. It could take me where I want to be in, in the spectrum and in the, 
the 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 wideness of what I want to be, where I want to be, with the people that I want to be, the people that I want to meet. I want to travel. I want to go to Italy. I want to go to Paris. I want to go to um, London. I want to go to all these incredible places, which are top-notch places, and meet the Queen Elizabeth. You know, the Queen of England. Why not? You know, that's like ideal. That's something that most people don't really think about, but I think about it because. Who wouldn't want to meet these type of people? You know, they've been around for so long. They've done amazing work. They've done things for the community. They've done things that are remarkable. And why not meet them and greet them and possibly have a connection with them?